Hey there, YouTube, how are you guys doing? What's up? So, here in Swanee, Sri Lanka, beautiful morning day, and I'm having my first bowl of the day. As you can see, I'm housekeeping my falcon pipe, and I've not been seeing any YouTubers using falcons these days, so I thought, you know, I might as well pull out my falcon and show it off. Absolutely a beautiful smoking pipe and seriously guys you got to have at least one of these in your rotation to give it a try It's really really cool smoking pipe literally a cool smoking pipe. So Saying that today's topic is um, your flake tobacco Do you rub it out or do you fold and stuff? And the pros and cons of rubbing out and you know fold and stuff Now, as you guys do know, I've been I've been opening up a tin of University Flake, one year aged University Flake, and uh, I rarely smoke, uh, you know, unless I'm doing a YouTube video. So uh, I've been smoking this for about at least three weeks now. I smoke a bowl maybe about two or three days, one in two or three days time. So I'm a bit of a slow smoker these days because I work and all but uh, I've improved since I used to not smoke at all for about uh, uh, a month because I was just too busy so university flame uh, if you guys haven't seen what it looks like let me show it to you this is what the flake looks like I sadly don't have water focus but uh, it is wow it smells beautiful seriously I just love this so, University Flake, I used to, uh, when I first got it, um, I used to rub it out. Now, the way I used to rub it out is, you can actually just rub it out with your fingers. Or, what I do is, I just take a small knife and actually chop it up into like a granule form. And then I add it into my pipe. Now, rubbing out is just using your fingers and, uh, you know, chopping it up into small granules is another thing. Both work fantastic. So, pros and cons of that to actually the fold and stuff method. So, after a really long time, I thought I'll fold and stuff my tobacco in this because I know I can only put about one uh, flake in this compared to my other pipes, which are much more larger and I could pick more like uh, two to three uh, flakes in that chopped up so the rubbing out method is much more easier to fill your pipe than the uh, you know folded stuff and also I've noticed that uh, the pipe it keeps lit better when it's in a, 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 a rubbed out version or a, a granule version than the actual um, you know fold and stuff as I've been lighting this pipe a shit lot of times because it just keeps going now. Damn. Also, when it's in a rubbed out form, uh, you tend to uh, use your tamper as you'd normally do. But when it's in a um, when it's in the fold and stuff method, the tobacco is rock hard, so you really don't have to tamp. I know why I keep taking my tamper out. So you got to tamp less when it's in the fold and stuff method. But uh, when it's in a in a uh, granule form or in a rubbed out form, you need to tamp like your normal tobacco. Then when it comes to the actual burning qualities, like I said. Um, the rubbed out version uh, smokes perfectly but uh, this one takes a little bit of lighting up and uh, another one more thing that I did notice that the actual temperature of the smoke changes yeah that would be pretty funny like when you when it's in a rubbed out version the smoke is a tad bit hotter now remember guys I didn't say tongue bite here I just said that the smoke is a tad bit hotter than when it's in the uh, fold and stuff method. This is absolutely cool. But 
I do not know this for sure because I'm using a falcon pipe and um, falcons come with a aluminum stem so it naturally is supposed to cool the smoke so I don't know whether it's this or I don't know whether it's the fold and stuff method but I have read that uh, when you do the fold and stuff method the tobacco is a lot more cooler than when it's uh, actually rubbed out keeps going out final verdict whether it's going to be rubbed out or whether it's going to be folded stuff rubbed out seriously guys i hate relighting my pipe it's bloody annoying look at how many times it goes off i don't know for me rubbed out no way i'm doing this folded stuff method again but guys i'd like to hear comments um, about folded stuff and rubbed out and uh, all the things about flake Saying that, guys, I'm going to say adios, amigos. I have a busy day.